Hi Dollar Tree friends, back with another Dollar Tree haul this fine Saturday. I have a ton of stuff. This is going to be a really long video, I can already tell. I was going to split it up in two and I said, what the heck, it's Saturday, let's have some fun. I don't even know where to start. Uh, okay, we'll start with tomorrow. My girlfriends and I are having a brunch for our birthdays. There's eight of us and we are celebrating all of our birthdays at once. We all kind of stagger um, throughout the year. So we just do it in one shot. So for that little, we're having a brunch tomorrow at my house. I'm hosting it. So I picked up some party napkins, luncheon napkins, if you will. You get 25 of these. It says right on there, it's your day with the cake. I think it's so cute, so cute. So we got a pack of those, 25. I got a table cloth, table runner, table, table cover. It's the plastic vinyl. So I got that to put over the kitchen table to put our spread on. I picked up 48 of the heavy duty plastic forks. You don't need 48 obviously, but they're always good to have on hand. So once the brunch is over, these will go in the silverware drawer. I grabbed four of these cards. I'll just show you real quickly how cute they are with the little glitter on them. I got one for each of the girls who we are celebrating. So cute. Two for a dollar. Cards are two for a dollar at Dollar Tree. So pretty. And this one. Um, most of them are two for five dollars. So, or, I'm sorry, two for a dollar. Some of them are one dollar the bigger ones with like the 3d pieces um, attached to them those are a dollar so you have to look in the section it'll say two for a dollar or just one dollar so i picked up those for the girls i also got this centerpiece that i will be throwing on in the middle of the table just surrounded by all of our brunch items everybody's bringing something to share so just something to add to the table for our little celebration i am making one of the girls a gift i hope she's not watching this if she is she's not going to know which one there's eight of us and i think five of us are celebrating the birthdays so i picked up three of these sticker sheets they call them tile decal because they peel and it's a sticker i am not using these for that however i am going to cut hearts out little baby hearts right here on the main picture um, I have three of those that I'm going to cut out a heart on each of them. I might be able to squeeze two hearts on one. If so, I'll just keep the stickers for something else. And then I'm going to stain this wood piece with the little hanger at the top. I'm going to stain it and I'm going to put the hearts going down. And then I'm going to trace them with hot glue and twine. I've made this before. I don't know if any of you guys remember that, but I made this project before and my girlfriend who I made it for absolutely loved it. Speaking of things that I made, I wanted to share with you guys the latest. I started this a while ago. Um, it spells home. I took the barnyard piece from Dollar Tree and some greenery and just covered the O. I thought it was so cute with the galvanized metal. And then I just paint stained this. Well, I painted it white and then distressed it. So it says home and it hangs up in the kitchen. It's so cute. It goes well with my piggy, with my piggy and my cow. 
So I just wanted to share that with you guys. I grabbed, they only come in a six pack and I didn't want to get two. So I have some other champagne glasses, but that's what these are, champagne glasses, disposable um, for tomorrow because we're having mimosas. So I grabbed six of those. Okay, I have to mail my oldest daughter who lives in Oregon her Easter gifts. So I picked up just a mailing envelope Handle with Care, Fragile, uh, it has the bubble wrap on the inside. So I grabbed one of those to give her a gift out to her. It's super duper late and I'm bummed. I want her to have it as soon as possible. I found this, I'm so happy. It's Super Fruit Lip Smacker Kiss Therapy. I love the packaging. I love the lips on there. I think that is so cute. This one is super fruit and it's made with coconut and jojoba oils. Let's see, it's SPF 30. This will be good to keep in your beach bag. If you are headed out into the sunshine. Oh, this is cute. You roll it at the bottom. Oh, this is nice, guys. This is nice. Mm-hmm. Very good. Mm, it tastes great. This is great. Lip Smacker. You know where I found this? I found this in the medicine aisle. There are a lot of chapsticks and lip glosses, or not lip glosses, lip moisturizers in the medicine aisle so be sure to keep your eyes out in that aisle by the vitamins and cough drops so be sure to keep your eye out for some lip therapy in that aisle i picked up the washing machine cleaner deep clean form formula um, i know that you get three in here three pouches it says it helps remove odors causing residues in any washer I have never thought about washing my washing machine. I, it says for any, and any is all caps, washing machine. Pour one pouch of washing machine cleaner directly into your washer tub where odors and residues can occur. And you have to have it on hot water. Pardon me while I turn my washer off. Give me one moment. I am so sorry about that. I do not want you guys to have to listen to that thing go on and on and on. I picked up, which are marked 50 cents now, two of the peeps. I got cotton candy and party cake. My son loves these. They're 50 cents each now. They're trying to get rid of all of their um, Easter candy and all of it was 50 cents. So keep your eye out for that. Okay, I got, for another one of the girlfriends, I got this clay mask and scrub by Freeman. It is a cleansing apple cider vinegar clay mask and scrub. I think... Instantly tones, purifies, and mattifies for a flaw flawless complexion. It's pink. Ooh, it smells like banana. Huh. It smells like banana. Since 1976. Wow. Wow, that smells delicious. One of them will be very happy. I needed some soy sauce. This is the biggest bottle you're going to find, and it's $1.25. It tastes exactly like Le Choy. Um, this is where I get my soy sauce all the time, all the time. Then I picked up these two candles, a pink, I'm sorry, a purple and a white. And this is going to be for another girlfriend. Well, both of them. 
are going to be for a girlfriend. The white one, I am going to take one of these butterflies. You get two sheets. How many do you get on here? Does it tell you? I'm surprised it doesn't tell you because you get a lot on here. So let's do this one. I just want to show you exactly what I'm going to be doing. I'm going to take the white candle and it has this on it. I'm going to get this off. Um, and then I'm just going to take the sticker and place it onto the candle. Get all your bumps out. And look at how beautiful that looks. I'm going to Mod Podge a little bit. You don't have to. You definitely do not have to. But I do want to get this sticker off. So I'm going to make this for one of the girls. And then I picked up these. These mermaid stickers. Love, love love them for the purple one this one i'm gonna have to wait because this one has a paper on it so i want to get this paper off these papers see they usually just peel right off there we go just peels right off it's just a protective coat of some sort but these mermaids this one i believe is the one that fits on it perfectly because it is, it's gonna be wrapped around the whole thing. So I will show you these. I'm, I'll take some photos before I give them away as gifts and show you guys how the mermaid one turned out and the butterflies. I, I can't wait to put those on there. It should be a cute little present. I finally found some of the hand soap. Delta Home Kitchen Lemon. I'm so excited to have this at my sink. It smells so good, you guys. Yeah, it smells just like lemon. Ooh, gets your mouth going. Gets your mouth going. Nothing like soap to get your mouth going. Wow, that smells delicious. They had some other flavors, but flavors, scents, but um, I didn't care for them. I didn't care for them. So, excuse me. Modelo mango chili. Delicious. Okay. So there's that. For the mask, this is going to go with the mask that I got. The Freeman mask that I just showed you. It's an applicator. It is a dual-ended facial mask applicator. So I'm gonna stick these together as a gift. Just a little something. We just do a little something for each other. We don't, um, you know, we do stuff throughout the year together that we spend our money on. So we try to keep it very small. Nothing like the Dollar Tree to help you out with that. I picked up these banana nut muffins it says just add milk so i'm gonna make these for the brunch tomorrow too i'm also making a hash brown casserole which i've never done so that should be interesting but we'll see but i figured i'd make a little dessert for everybody too just to just to give that sugar crave away i picked up some rose flowers I'm not sure where these are going to go yet. Probably my planner. Um, I don't know. My calendar. We'll see. Somewhere from my journal. I'll find a place for them, I promise. I have a nice little sticker collection. All right. I found these. They're rose LED flower lights. 120 total hours. So... 60 hours, 60 hours is what they're talking about. So I loved these. I think they're beautiful. I bought them for something that I'm going to make. I don't know what it is yet, but these were part of it. Once I figure out what that is, I will let you know. I found this. 
little adorable, God, what can you call it? Coastal pick. It's so cute. It has the seahorse on it with all of its little coral pieces. I just loved it. And I'm making a wreath for one of the girls for her birthday. She is really into the beach. She loves the beach and this whole coastal living life line that is coming out at Dollar Tree is amazing. I, I would like to do my entire bathroom in it, to be honest with you. I found for her wreath, I'm going to be hot gluing this onto her wreath. It is just your simple anchor, but it's so beautiful. I love the color. It comes with the jute rope at the top. I think this is going to come off and I'm just going to hot glue this right onto the wreath. So that's cute. Along with the seahorse that I have. Um, okay, I have, I picked up this glass sticker. You get to decorate a glass with these. And I picked up, let's see if I can get it without breaking anything. I picked up one of Dollar Tree's glasses. And I'm just going to decorate it real pretty for one of the girls. One of them. One of them will be the lucky winner. I'm not sure who I'm giving what to yet, but I think this is going to turn out to be super, super cute. These stickers are absolutely adorable. I love the seahorse. I love the seahorse on here. And the char they're all so super cute. So yeah, so that will be fun. I will make that. That will be fun. I also found these, which in the summer for my tear tray, I think I'm going to go nautical and these will be a great addition to my tear tray. But for now, they're going on her wreath. So these will be going on the wreath as well. I'll have to show you guys because it's going to be going to be a good one. I picked up these starfish. You get three in a pack. I don't know if you can see very well with, but they're the starfish. There we go. You get three in there and they're good. They're, they're good. So I got the starfish and then I got the sand dollars and you get three in this one as well. I don't know what they're made out of. It doesn't say, it just says poly silver. So unless you know what that means, it's made from poly silver, I'm assuming, I guess. But these are going on the wreath as well. So I think the wreath is going to be perfect. Let me just show you. I did some shopping at Goodwill yesterday too. And I wanted to show you this will be going in the middle of the wreath. I picked this up at Goodwill. Mermaid Kisses and Magical and Starfish Wishes. So cute. It's supposed to be distressed like that and it matches all of the colors so perfectly well. So that's gonna be in the middle of her wreath. So cute. I grabbed some Chewy, chewy, safe hide wonder snacks for the pup. So she's had a couple. I think you get, they're made with peanut butter, so you know they love them. Easy to digest, high in protein, low in sugar. I think you get eight of them because she's had quite a few. And the best by date is 623. So this is for my little puppers. My daughter was with me at one store and she picked up the Jet Puffed Marshmallow Cream. She has never had this before. I don't know where this came from to her mind to want, but I told her she can try it. If she likes it, then good. If not, the dollar twenty-five. I needed some distress distress brushes 
just to, um, their, their bristle, bristles are a little bit rougher. So when you want to distress something, you just barely blot it and it makes it look distressed. So these are two inches. So I, I needed these. I'm glad I found these. These were in the hardware aisle, not the crafter square. They were in the hardware aisle. Tool bench. Tool bench is like that aisle with the toolboxes and the razor blades and stuff like that. So look for those there. I We needed a new pair of toenail clippers, sassy and chic. Seem to have misplaced ours. So nothing like Dollar Tree to help you out finding your nail clippers. I have been doing the gel nail polish. My girlfriend bought me a kit for my birthday and I am telling you, this stuff does not come off. I've soaked my fingers for several minutes. Um, it just does not come off. So, Sassy and Chic has a gel polish remover tool, which I'm willing to try because this stuff, this is like super glued on there. And yeah, it's not going to chip and it looks good and it's gonna hold the color. But when it's time to change the color, you know, hopefully this comes in handy and can get this gel nail polish off because I can't. So hopefully that will help. I picked up a pack of number stickers just to have on hand. We are going to be using those in the summer with Naomi, my daughter, who's seven, um, keeping up with our math skills. We're going to do some fun stuff this summer. She's doing really good in school, and I don't want that to stop. Uh, she's got a little runny nose, so she said, Mom, can I get some tissue? And I said, absolutely. Simple softness puffs, good stuff. Um, you open here. It's so nice, it's very easy. And how many sheets do you get? 96, 96. So she um, she picked those out, it was really cute. Snapple, I grabbed one of these. This one is the Fruit Punch. I grabbed the apple last time, very good. I'm very impressed with with these. Um, they spark up my water and I love it. I've been drinking so much more water now that I've discovered these um, packets. Dollar Tree has a ton of different flavors, all types. Take a peek. Take a peek and see what, um, it, what entices you. Okay, back to the nautical. I mean... Oh, how cute are these? They would look so cute in my bathroom. I could make some more sconces to put it on. So this one is the starfish. Then you have this one, which is my favorite, the seahorse. I mean, come on. Are these not? I mean, this one looks like fish scales, like a mermaid tail. I just love them. I don't know what I'm going to do with these. They're obviously not going to fit on the wreath. I don't know. Do I give him, do I give her them separately? I don't know. Do I keep them? My bathroom now is plants. It's a plant theme. I don't really want to change it. It looks really cute. But this nautical theme has me like some type of way. So maybe I can switch my upstairs bathroom. It's my husband's bathroom. Maybe he'll let me switch his. Okay, that's a thought. I'm going to have to go there. I grabbed these because they matched the whole theme of the wreath. They have all the different colors in there. So what am I going to do with these? Am I going to hot glue them onto the wreath? I don't know. 
I, I don't know if I'm going to make a garland maybe and have it wrapped around the wreath. That might be what I'll do. It's like you got to get playing with it before you can figure out what you're going to do exactly. So I got those. I found this and I'm just like Dollar Tree. It's a tooth whitening system and you get this little mouth guard. Then you squirt this five minute whitening gel into the mouth guard and you hold it in your mouth for five minutes and then you take it out and brush your teeth. Okay, I'm ready to try it. The picture looks a little amazing. So why not? Let's see how it goes. I'll take a before and after picture like that. I also picked up for the face mask and the face mask applier an ultrasonic face mister. I thought this was so cool. Instant dewy skin glow on the go. I think it's so cute. It just lets out a little mist right there. It's portable. I wonder if it's battery operated. I have batteries here, so I will fill it with batteries. Rechargeable battery. Rechargeable battery. This is adorable. And this will go really good with the face mask and the applier. That's what I'm going to do. I haven't seen this in Dollar Tree yet. Tough Plus All Purpose Cleaner Spray. You know, the bolder one that I bought, I haven't even used yet because I got scared. Um, Pookie's review. She did not enjoy it. And she said it was probably one of the worst things that she's ever smelt in her life. I'm not even going to attempt. I'm going to bring it to the pantry, our local food pantry. I'm dropping off a bunch of stuff. I'm going to stick it in there and hopefully, hopefully somebody who will like it will get it. Because I'm not even going to go there. I'm not going to waste it. Thanks, Pookie, for that review, by the way. I saw this and I figured for my my banana muffins that I'm going to make, why not? Look. Look at this. Oh, it's on all fours. Look at that. I mean, this is great. This is great. It has an enclosure on each side. Wow. And then it has the handle to hold at the top. So this is going to be, there's nine spots. So this is going to be for our muffins. That I just, for $1.25 I picked it up. I You can't, what else am I going to display those on? I'm not. I would just have them sitting on my stove probably. Then I got this plate. As you can see, it's glass see-through. I'm going to decoupage um, a napkin onto this. I haven't done that yet. I haven't done a decoupage yet. So I figured this will be my first time doing so. I picked up some napkins to use. So I'm going to give it a go. I'm just going to see what I can do. And then you can put that up as like a decoration. Once you decoupage it, I grabbed one of these step shelves. Um, I got mine for our spice rack. It's just keeps, it keeps collecting more spices and it's running out of room. So I got this in hopes that I can put, I think one, two, three, four, four will fit on each thing on each level. So I grabbed this. I hope it will work. If not, I know I can find something um, to use this for all of my glue, or I'm sorry, all of my paint, something. I know I'll get my use out of it. Naomi also, for her sister, picked up a box of mac and cheese. That's 
what she picked for her sister. I have no clue. Okay, now this I love. It's the kids' storage bag. Okay, it's for the bathtub to put all of their toys in. I have to see this. I have to see it because it looks super cute. Oh, it is super cute, you guys. It has these little suction cups on the back so you can hook it up to your tub. It's pretty big. It's a pretty big one. And then you just put your toys in here when you're done in the bathtub. Love it. Love it. This will be going in my daughter's bathroom in her tub. She will really like that. Then she can clean up her toys. I picked these up for my son. They're by Juncture. Just some taco socks for his, he hasn't picked up his Easter basket yet. He's away at school, so he should be coming home soon um, for a visit. So I'm gonna stick these in his basket before he gets here. I thought they were really cute. I picked up Hungry Jack pancake mix. I love a good pancake and waffle. You just add water to this. How much easier can a breakfast be? I may even make these tomorrow. Just have some flapjacks if anybody wants one. So I may make those. But what I did do, in case I don't, in case I don't make the pancakes tomorrow, I got my labels out from Dollar Tree. I got all my labels. I got them out and I'm going to label this pancake mix. I'm going to take this off. I'm going to label this pancake mix and I'm going to pour my mix into the container and what I do, I cut the back of the box off and I stick it facing me so I can see the directions. I don't really need directions on how to make pancakes, but just in case somebody wants to make some that doesn't know, then they'll know that the pancake mix is in here. So I love these containers from Dollar Tree. They're my, those are my favorite containers that they have. Okay, Naomi also grabbed some double bubble. I don't know why she is not supposed to be eating gum. I have no idea how this got in my cart, but I know it was from her. So we're going to have to have a little chat later. She also, she did ask for these, the Kool-Aid Pops. You get 20 and you get all those flavors. All you got to do is place them in the freezer. And then you snip off the top. Some good flavors on there. So she got those. And she also asked if she could get dinosaurs for her snack at school. They get a snack, I think, at 10 o'clock. So she wanted those. Okay. Uh, oh, I found these, you guys. I'm so excited. I told you, I showed you the coffee. I hauled that one before the caramel latte. Oh, so good so good once it's really cold and actually I blended some ice and poured this in there and it was so good it was like a frappuccino it was really good so I got another caramel and these are keto friendly and then I found peppermint mocha latte so that will be interesting that that it sounds good. Zero added sugars, 10 grams of protein, 200 milligrams of caffeine, no artificial sweeteners, 70 calories. I love these. I am so happy that Dollar Tree has these. There's, Jewel sells them for a pretty penny. Get them at Dollar Tree, guys. Get them at Dollar Tree. Another Naomi by these hot chips that she loves, I, I don't know how she can handle them, but they're her favorite. She loves them. She loves them. She eats them all the time. I 
picked up one of the multi-purpose cleaning pastes. I've had mixed reviews about this. Um, it cleans everything under the sun. And it's just a paste that you smooth on and then you wipe it off. I picked this up for my girlfriend. She's really been looking for it and wanted it, so I grabbed it for her. Um, she has a gas top, no, I'm sorry, an electric top stove, and this is gonna work perfect on that. So I want her to try this out and let me know because I wanna use it in my refrigerator. But nowhere on here does it say that. So I don't know. But she's gonna test it out and let me know, and I'll let you guys know. Okay, I had to pick up the blueberry pomegranate licorice, one of my favorites. You know, they have the sour apple, watermelon, red, black, and pomegranate blueberry. This is my favorite. They're all delicious, but the blueberry pomegranate is my personal favorite. Naomi picked out this cute little book she wanted. She It is Hansel and Gretel, but it's color by number. So she's gonna have to follow the numbers with what colors. And we don't usually like these markers that they give you. They're just not good markers. So we'll replace them with the markers we have here and she can still color, she can still color all the photos by number. So. I was happy she picked that out. That was a good one. I'm all for coloring, art, learning, math. I'm all for it. This, this is cool. This is just cool. Surfs up surface. Summer trivia questions. I need to read one of these cards because I am so intrigued. So intrigued. Okay. Here we go. It's all summer facts. Okay. True or false? So watermelon will grow in your belly if you eat the seeds. True. And then if you pick false, it gives you the answer. It gives you the answer and an explanation. What is the ball called in badminton? A feather ball, a bocce ball, a shuttlecock, or a paddle ball? It's a shuttlecock. Didn't know that. How many strikes do you get in baseball before you were out? Two, three, four, five. Three. These are cute. These are cute. This is just a little something for $1.25 that me and my daughter can sit in the backyard and just soak up the sun while we are getting our summer facts straight. She picked out the puppy, the puppy in my pocket surprise. She said I could open it and for all of you. We're gonna see which one we got this time. Oh, we don't have him. I don't see him on here. Cindy, it's a girl. It's Cindy. She's a cutie. Little pair of sunglasses on there. It doesn't. Pekingese. She's a Pekingese. Cute. Very cute. So I will stick that away for her to play with. She is trying to collect all of them, and we have four. So. We already have her, so we still have four, but that's okay. That's okay. All right, I had to pick up a cream of chicken soup for my hash brown casserole tomorrow. I have no idea what cream of chicken soup is doing in there, but I, it's supposed to be delicious, so I, I don't know. Uh, Naomi picked up some new toothpaste. She let me know she was running out, which is really helpful when she does that. So we always have it on hand for her. And then, let's see, we got a couple more things. And then she picked out bathtub finger paint in this like minty color. 
just some bathtub fun. Just some fun to do in the bathtub. She has a couple other, this one is sea green. She has a couple other ones too. Um, okay, and then she wanted to do this. Is it gonna work? Let's see. It is the United States. And it has all of the states at the bottom. She wants to fill up every time we go to a state. So we have to go through this tonight and pick which ones we've been to. She's been to a couple here. So we're going to fill that out for her. I thought that was really cute for a little kid. My oldest daughter has one that's huge and you scratch off each um, each state that you visit so I'm 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 willing to do this with her I think it will be super fun and something to look forward to when we go new places and lastly for my Dollar Tree haul this was a must because because it lights up it is a palm tree drink bottle that lights up. If you don't know how to spend a dollar twenty-five, this is how. This is how. LED tumbler, goblet. And you just push the bottom. You just push the bottom. There's a little hole down there. I love this. I'm drinking out of, I should be drinking my Modelo out of this. That's what I should be doing. Then it would be more tropical. And it blinks for quite some time before you have to push it again. So I thought it was super cute. I'm 16 fluid ounces. Doesn't look that big, but it is. So that is my Dollar Tree haul. Um, I have a couple things that I got from the Goodwill that I wanted to show you guys. I found these little book boxes. They have, they have put Silent Night, Holy Night stars on the top. I'm obviously painting this. I'm doing farm, farm style for my tear tray. And then they had this one, Frosty the Snowman. I'm just going to take all of that off and paint these the way I want them painted to go on my tear tray. I also found this cute little thing. It's just a cute little birdhouse. Super cute. It has the ABCs going around the top. So this is going to be painted. I'm not sure. This is going to go on my spring tear tray in the front in our mud room. I'm gonna paint it up real pretty, pink, purple, blue, um, yellow, you know, colors for, for spring. But it was 50 cents, so were these. So, you know, what, what are you gonna do? You're gonna buy it, you're gonna buy it for 50 cents. Then, my girlfriend for tomorrow for our brunch, she's a big elephant collector. She loves elephants. I found some elephant garland. So I'm going to hang that up for her. She's going to love that. The, it's the little things that we all enjoy getting from other people. Little tiny things like that. I know she's going to love that. She's going to love it. Then I found this for 50 cents for my spring tray. It needs a little work. I'm gonna put some Spanish moss down in here. I'm gonna paint these. I'm gonna repaint these and stick them back in there. They just pull right out. I like the I like the pot the way it is, but um, I'm gonna repaint the cactus. And then I found for my wreath this little boat and oar. I found that one a quarter. And then I found this one for 50 cents. 
I'm going to take this little silver thing off there and somehow incorporate this into the wreath. It's got the anchor on there. I love it so much. So, so much. And I think that's it, guys. My nice 45 minute long video for you. I hope you enjoyed all the things that I brought to the table today. Um, anything you guys want to see, leave me a comment on the things that I'm working on. Just shoot me a comment. And um, if you haven't already subscribed to my page, please do so. I try to do a haul twice a week is what I go for. Sometimes I only get to do once a week, but I try to go for two. So hit that notification button so you don't miss any of my lives and you don't miss any of my do-it-yourself end results. So everybody have a happy Saturday. Enjoy the sunshine and take care.